Hey guys, welcome back, and today we're going to do part two of the Canada Garage video. The last one went on a streak. It got like 46 views like three hours, two hours after I uploaded it. It was crazy. Thank you for the support. And now we're going to move on to the next part of the story. So here's what happened. So we get a plan, so we get some salmon, we put it in a plate, of course, we put it on the ground, we tie some string on it, this is our plan, so then we wait for the cat to come out and show itself, and it looked very orangey, and I called him Ginger, what else would I call him? So, Ginger went to go get it. I'm going to name him that the rest of the video. And he ate it, of course. So, my mom pulled the string and went a little bit farther. And then he, she went farther. Ginger went farther. And then did that until all the way until she came out. But it took a little bit of a long time. She almost... Well, Ginger almost entered the house. It was a tragedy. We were like, oh, shoot. But nothing bad happened. It was okay. So that's pretty much it. It was just a little short video. And he went So he went away. Pretty much his whole neighborhood is his house. And then we thought we made a horrible mistake. Here's the horrible mistake. If cats find food somewhere, and they remember that place, they'll keep going in there for all the meals. That means it's going to keep coming and coming to our house. Until someone else starts feeding it. So that's going to be a problem for a little while. I hope it's not going to be so long, because it's going to get burned. It's going to be like, okay, we have a pet cat. But we really don't. So I'm just going to tell you the plan that we did to get rid of him. And finally, he was gone. It was all good. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So thank you guys for watching. Please leave a like. And let's try to get 100 views on this. Like the only two videos. <laughs> so see you guys next time. See ya. Bye.